Graham Hart makes six changes to the 11 that started last week's win over Aki's. Goalkeeper AJ Meach was only announced as a United player at 11 o'clock. Megan Saidi is out with an ankle injury. Kira Tutor also makes her debut. Rangers just got past Partick Thistle last week with a 1-0 win. The only change to the 11 is Laura Berry for Sarah Ewans. Can they take advantage when City and Celtic aren't playing? Into the feet of debutant Kira Tutor, who takes aim and strikes it into the top corner. A dream debut moment. 31 seconds into it for Kira Chitter. And United have dared to poke the bear here. Midag. Rangers with bags of time to get back into this. They'll expect to do so. How long can United last as McLaughlin clips it in? Here's how it. Not very long. Less than five on the clock. 1 1 already. And Kirsty Howitt keeps her composure in front of goal to level. Loads of space here for McCauley. Early cross. Berry. Midag. Good save from Meach. Who can expect a busy debut. There's McLaughlin. Fields, shot at goal blocked. Half hearted claims for a penalty have resulted in the award. Hardy for 2 1. Yep, never in doubt. And it's only taken 18 minutes for Rangers to turn it around. Rio Hardy continues her fine run of goal scoring forms and signing in the summer. Hardy. Looks like she might just keep that in. Takes a moment to assess her surroundings. Lose it off for Midag. That's an absolutely beautiful finish from Tesso Midag. Taking over the midfield goal scoring mantle with Chelsea Cornet out injured. Need Noble. Loose pass in completely different wavelengths. Rangers looking to go for a fourth here. Berry, Hardy, oh, wonderfully done. Whipped in to the far corner, and Hardy is now Rangers' top scorer for the season on five. McLean. McLaughlin. McLean again. Oh, it's beautiful. Kirsty Howitt, she had to wait for her fifth start of the season to get one. The winner against Thistle last week, now she has a double. Would expect a long second half here for United. We got off to the ideal start. There is such a thing as scoring too early though. Meech is able to claim as Howitt loitered. Corner cleared. Initially, that was a weak defending though as Midag clips one back in. Hardy almost got there. On the second attempt, not on, too far away to the post, Rio Hardy. That one's got a bit more fizz on it. Oh, off the crossbar from Young Jardin. Jardin happy on her left. Doherty couldn't get there. United inviting the pressure. Jardin across goal. Howitt. Oh, another stunning goal from Kirsty Howitt, who claims her hat trick. And all of a sudden, she has four for the season. Then she's perfect. Greenwood. Napping. Jardin. Lovely zip on the ball for McLaughlin. The rain aiding the turf there. Oh, what a wonderful finish from McLean. Her first of the season and in some style. Come on, Rangers 
find another one. Oh, this fizz just wide. Nearly Austin. Doherty. Well, it's Berry brought down. And I think she's annoyed she didn't get the opportunity to pull the trigger. Hardy scores, and that's it. And as the game begins to draw to a close. I thought the girls were excellent and they worked hard, but um, just key moments and key decisions at, at certain times probably just led to us obviously losing some, some poor goals. I thought we were clinical. I thought we showed a real good quality in front of goal, both you know individually and as a collective. So, yeah, really pleased.